Hello healers, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today you have your Yasuno Pick a Card of the Week and this is going to be a special collab with my friend Nat from Spiritual Guidance with Nat. Nat has a lovely channel with many different videos for you, pick a card, zodiac sign readings, deck reviews and much more. So do check her out, she is a lovely, lovely person. So check her channel as well, I'm sure you'll like it. She's going to have a yes or no bigger card in her channel as well. So if you want to choose the one of the piles here and go after to her channel and check as well her piles, you know, it maybe you want to choose the same one, maybe a different one. You see which one resonates. And like always, leave us know if it helps you out in some way, you know, just make sure you check her out. All the details below, all the links below. And if you want to have the cards that I use for yourself, if you wanted to have a private reading, if you wanted to contact me or support this channel, all the details will be there and the timestamp as well. Okay, this is going to be group number one, two, and three. Group one with the, the dice crystal. Okay, this is group two with the heart. And group three here with this lovely crystal. Okay. Just bring it a bit closer to you in case it helps you. Like always, go with your gut feeling. Your first choice is most likely the right one. But of course, you can see the full video, see which one resonates. Go to Nat's channel, see the full video as well. And leave me a comment. Let me know if it helps you out in some way. And like always, just make sure you have your question that you know the answer is yes or no, or if you should say yes or no to something, okay? Just with some more details. And I will be adding some days, some weeks with the longer videos and other videos, quick ones with the quick yes or no and just an advice, okay? So it just will be a balance between the longer videos, the shorter videos. So there are plenty of videos there for you to see which one helps you out, okay? And I hope it helps you in some way. Like always, let me know. This again, group number one, two, and three, timestamp below. Thanks for watching. Group number one, if you chose this beautiful dice crystal, we leave here to help us out. You know your question already. We have here Knight of Swords, Four of Pentacles, The Wheel, also purpose and this beautiful card here never stop dreaming beautiful group one straight away here we have the knight of swords okay as you can see here on the picture he's running after you know his bike in this case here or he's running after something he wants okay so i feel like things can turn your way here okay but you will need it to run okay after what you want here so there will be also because it's the sword, something for you to cut away. So it's like you you will need to work a little bit hard to bring this into your reality, okay? But it's not impossible. There's also the Four of Pentacles because it's representing you holding on to something maybe too tight, maybe something that you needed to release a little bit, okay? Could be money as well that maybe you do need to save. So it's a case here. So we'll see which one resonates, guys. Are you holding on too tight or you need to release, okay? Whether it's the relationship, the other person, too much jealousy or money, you're spending too much when you shouldn't be concentrating on your business or your career, you know, take what resonates like always. But it's really showing here, It's it could be either way, okay? Or are you holding on too tight or maybe it's time to save, to hold on to something that you need here, okay? So it could be, an extreme here of either way here maybe you're too jealous maybe you know you this the situation here the relationship or maybe you're not giving space to each other or maybe you're not saving enough money for your business the things you need to do so see which one resonates here guys because the will is here so you can go finally this will turning your way okay so finally you can bring this into your reality if you want so guys yes this can be yes for you okay so i feel like this is yes for you but it's not without work okay so you will need to run after what you want here and you will need to know what it is that you will need to cut away because the sword is here meaning you're going to need to use a bit of your logic your mind your intelligence not being so emotional when you need when you need to cut something you're going to need it to be straightforward honest okay and when you have the purpose here i know what i am here to do so when you have this purpose, the goal, the focus, okay, you know where you're running, like the night here, 
you know where you're running after or who you're running after, depending on your situation here, your question. You know your purpose and you can get there. You can turn the wheel around, but there will be some work, okay? There will be something that you need to focus here, guys, whether it's releasing or holding, okay? You see which extreme you are here right now and uh, you're gonna need to cut away something here to open the door, but it can open the door, okay, guys? You can open the door because we do have, have here never stop dreaming. So if this is part of your dreams, this question is part of your purpose, okay? Yes, when you focus, when you run after what you want, you can manifest. So yes, you can bring this into your reality, okay, guys? So this is a yes for you, but not without work, like I said, okay? So there will be some work to be done here. There will be some purpose, some goal, and something that you may need to release here, okay? Maybe you're holding too tight, or maybe it's time to hold something finally here and safe, like I say, or not being so jealous, you know, depending of, of course, your question, all right? So take what resonates, but you will need to run after something here, guys, okay? Doesn't mean that there's no work here. And use your logic, your intelligence, if you need to cut away something here that's not serving your purpose. So it could be a situation, a person, uh, an attitude, something needs to be cut away and then you're going to be able to run and see the door and see the light at the end of this tunnel, okay, when you run after what you want. It's going to be a bit of work, but this yes coming to you, okay, guys, I don't feel like it's going to fall straight away on your lap because you need to turn this wheel around, but things are finally turning. And remember, your focus, your purpose, okay, don't stop dreaming. It's what you want, then go for it. There's no looking back here, okay, so go for what you want and uh, no regrets here and yes can come to you okay beautiful here for you guys some work to be done but you can achieve this okay and like i said check my friend nat okay the link will be below see maybe you want to check pile one as well and see what happens and i hope it helps you out and like always if it does let me know leave me a comment you know i'm always happy to hear from you i wish you a lovely blessed and healing day thanks for watching Group two, if you chose this beautiful heart crystal, we live here to help us out. You know your question. Alrighty. We have here the Knight of Wands. Also the Queen of Swords. And the Ten of Cups. Also Success. And heaven please send me your light so that i can share it beautiful card here for you group two straight away with the king of wands beautiful card here for you okay concentrating on your passions on your goals fulfilled really going for what you want here and not looking back okay so this is then the king of wands so it's really that attitude that you may need to take in this situation that is really with the purpose, knowing what you want, okay, your passions, you commit it, and you're serious about what you want, and then you can achieve it, okay? We do have the Queen of Swords here as well, which means you are really in time to use your logic, your mind, and maybe needing to cut away something that uh, is not serving you in this in this situation that you're trying to bring into your reality, manifest here, but it's a time that you can use your mind not so much emotions here in this case and then bring something into your reality something quite big here okay guys so because we do have the ten of cups so you will be able to use your logic your mind your intelligence but you're gonna bring something that is really emotional fulfilled okay is that family life for some of you if that's what you want is that fulfillment of having doing the job the business that you like that you you feel happy about it Okay, we do have success here. So no doubt here, group two, this is a yes for you. Okay, but this is coming with something that you needed to do. Okay, because the king of wands is someone who goes for the passion. Okay, so this is something here that to bring this ten of cups fulfillment here, this kind of emotional fulfillment, it will need to be something resonating with your heart, with your passions, something you really wanted to do. Maybe something you guys trying to do for a while and... Um, Maybe something that is always resonating in your heart and you didn't have the courage to, or you see, you know, take what resonates. But the Queen of Swords is here. So it means that for this to bring into your reality, for this to be yes, okay, 
for some of you guys, okay? Think what resonates because you may need to bring this into your reality. You will need to cut away something. There's a situation here that is not serving you, okay? And maybe stopping this door to open. And it's really time that you will be able to use your passions and use your logic, okay? Be firm with what you want and cut away something without looking back because the door you're going to open is going to be really beautiful. The Ten of Cups is really something you're going to be really happy with and so happy that you did something. So, so happy that you cut away something that was not helping you and happy that you did because when you will look back, whatever you had to cut away was worthy. Whatever you had to sacrifice will be worthy, okay? Because this is definitely yes for you. Success here, okay? I know that there is no greater goal than to love. So you see here, guys, if this is regarding your love, passions for your business, your job, or the other person that you're asking about, okay, the relationship, okay, there is a success here. So definitely yes for you guys, beautiful. And we do have heaven, okay, look at this picture, there's a beautiful card here, okay. So all the links below, guys, if you want to have those cards. You can see here, the, the image is beautiful. Heaven, please send me your light so that I can share it. So I feel like this success here, guys, this beautiful yes coming to you, these blessings coming with like the Ten of Cups will really bring us well something that something that you will be able to share with others, okay? So this light is not, these blessings, it's not going to be just for yourself. You will be able to help other people. You will be able to be there for someone that is in need, okay? And this is going to bring emotional fulfillment for you, for others, whoever is around you is involved here. So it's going to be blessings, guys, success pouring away you can see here like pouring the blessings that's going to bring light into your life and you're going to be able to share as well so this is really lovely beautiful here guys but you you just remember go for your passions don't compromise here and uh, cut away something that's not serving you here okay there may be a need for you there's a connection here very interesting here the picture is like connected here even though this is not uh, this is like the king of of one so the in the queen of swords different pictures but you can see here like they connect so there is a connection a beautiful connection here between your passions and your mind that you're going to have to combine use together to bring this into your reality maybe the communication that has to be really clear maybe whoever is involved with you okay you're going to be very straightforward focus on what you want here and you're bringing this ten of cups this success to you beautiful blessings here pouring your way guys Okay, this light that's going to be able to come to your life and others. So beautiful yes here for your group too. I hope this really helps you out, okay? Check my friend Nath as well. Maybe you wanted to check her pile number two as well. Or if you wanted to do something different, all the links below. I hope this helps you out. And like always, if it does, let me know. Leave me a comment. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group number three, if you choose this beautiful crystal here, we live here to help us out. You know your question already. We have here three of wands. Also the full. Also eight of cups. We have denial. And we have this beautiful card here. I read the full message in a bit. Very interesting here, group three, straight away with the three of wands. This is really showing that uh, something, the door, the way is going to finally open here for you. You're going to be able to see the light at the end of the tunnel and like see a way for you to resolve the situation or have this like uh, manifest into your life. Finally, see the things moving here for you. You're going to be able to see, like make a decision here and go for what you want. Okay, it's, it's with the wands. So it's regarding your passions. Something that you really want, something that maybe want for a while, something that resonates in your heart, and it's time to take that leap of faith and go. Because we have the full here, okay, which shows the leap of faith. It's like close your eyes and go, don't look back, stop looking back, it's time to move forward, really forward here. So this is very interesting here with the Eight of Cups, okay, guys, because you can see it's time to move on and like go, move away, okay there will be some travels for some of you maybe maybe it's like moving really city different place here or moving from this relationship moving from the situation seeing the light at the end of the tunnel and moving okay you know what is going on what is your question guys take what resonates but this is some progress some things like moving really forward here for you okay so this is a yes for you guys 
but you need to understand that this yes comes with you taking a leap of faith and moving from something okay so this here means like leaving something behind going for something better something that resonates with your heart with your passions and something that's going to be emotional fulfilled okay so really moving and growing as well okay so i feel like uh, if you're afraid of restarting of this is what is holding you back with this or when you manifest this yes or this is being yes in your life you just need to understand it comes with changes okay it doesn't mean just uh, saying yes and things are happy or just simple it means that they're going to leave something behind as well so there's a, could be some sacrifice with this coming away just uh, something that will be happy at the end of the tunnel it will be fulfilled okay that emotional fulfillment it will be able to bring into your reality with this yes coming to you but you will need to leave something behind as well and you need to, to it's a time to progress to finally move okay guys at least for some of you okay so there will be a need here to move so this yes comes to you will come with changes as well just so you understand that okay and denial is here so i acknowledge my fear but i replace it with the insight of awareness I feel like this is really related here to, to these two cards, okay? Because maybe you know that this yes coming to you or this meaning yes to you, there will be this fear as well that with the new, with the change, okay? Like the full, okay? You can see here, she closed her eyes and she's jumping. Doesn't mean like there's no fear at all, but it's just that trust that the, at the end here, you can see here, she's going towards the light. Things will be better, okay? You will finally see the way, the path going here for you to follow, okay? And uh, don't be afraid, guys, because this means like restarting for some of you, renewal, okay? Things like uh, moving. Doesn't mean like completely like ending a relationship for some of you. Could be just ending a phase of a relationship, moving forward, okay? If you're asking about relationship. But it could be like if it's a job, maybe you're leaving a, a different career behind, a different job, a different company, and then moving okay moving to your own business moving to a different place so you are leaving something behind it could be just a way of thinking could be your old self okay this is new guys something really new here so this yes coming to you it's beautiful yes okay definitely yes for you but don't stay in denial guys acknowledge the fear and move forward okay acknowledge you have the fear okay replace it replace it with inside of awareness awareness that you know that something is going to be better along the way you're going to see a light at the end of the tunnel you're following your heart your passions okay and it's not time to look back we also have here this beautiful card step out of being normal normal show yourself and then unique okay and be unique you can see here show yourself don't be afraid to be unique to be different if this yes coming your way means uh, being yourself you know, finally being able to speak the truth and be honest with whoever is around you. So that's the good thing, okay? Because you're going to see a beautiful progress, something beautiful at the end of this. So maybe there is some sacrifice. Maybe there is something that to leave behind. But you're going to be really happy with the resolution, with what you're going to see ahead. It's going to be more fulfillment, okay? Emotional fulfillment, growth here for you ahead, okay? With this light at the end of the tunnel. So beautiful yes here for you guys with some change. So don't be afraid just be yourself okay like always let me know if it helps you out okay check my friend nat as well maybe you want to check the same pile three or maybe a different one you see which one resonates and let me know if it helps you out okay leave me a comment you know i'm always happy to hear from you and as always i wish you a lovely blessed and healing day thanks for watching